the Cranbrook Bucks defeating the Pen de defeating the West Kona Warriors tonight, six to four. The final score. Uh, wild first period, caromed into what was a pretty wild and eventful hockey game. As we take a look back on uh, what was on the Saturday night here at Royal LePage Place, and it started for the Bucks to pick up the scoring 244 into the hockey game. Jacob Fletcher finds a handle and able to beat Rourke Appleby up and over his blocker's shoulder. Fletcher with a marker is fourth from Luke Foe and Jordan Murray. That gave Cranbrook a 1-0 lead before it was West Kelowna that got back in this hockey game. Moments after that, a 448. And Michael Salandra intercepts that pass from Carter Captain and finds the Back of the empty net as captain couldn't get back in time. Shorthanded goal, 12th of the year for Salandra. They made a 1-1 before this great pass by Jack Pridham. Looking back at the blue line, trying to, or was looking to possibly find Trey Osmus, but he goes back door. Great pass for Cal Hughes, who buries his 14th at 6:54. Hughes from Pridham and Isaiah Norlin. That made the game 2-1 uh, in favor of West. One of their only lead of the hockey game because Grammer came back moments later. At 8:48, Blake Cotton gets it across the blue line, takes a shot. Looked like it deflected off the stick of Trey Osmus into the back of the net. Cotton's fifth from Sammy Hines and Sam Belange. That made the game 2-2 before a 10-51. Cranbrook able to jump ahead by a 3-2 score. Julian Frias is 10th of the year in the front of the net. Banging home a rebound past Rorick Appleby. Donovan Frias and Joseph Blackley drawing the assist on the power play. That made it 3-2. Matthew Delarusso came on and well, the Bucks get a goal against him on another power play. Luke Foe's fifth of the year at 14.02. Side of the net, found that bouncing puck from Blake Cotton and fired it past. Julian Frias gathering another assist there on that power play marker. And it's a 4-2 game in favor of Cranbrook at that point before a giveaway by the Warriors. And Evan Brown got his way in, able to beat Delarusso up and over the glove side of the Warrior net. 16:46, the time of the goal. Brown's got his third, and that made the game 5-2. For the Warriors, got some momentum back late in the period. Just 32 seconds left in the frame. Brennan Nelson is seventh of the year, second and back to back night. Isaiah Norland spots him with a nice pass back door, and Nelson able to finish it off and pick up the marker. And it's a 5-3 game after just one period before early in the second, 101 in on a power play of their own. Isaiah Norland. Side of the net on a scramble, able to put it past the glove side of Carter. Captain Norland seventh from Felix Caron and Jack Pridham. That on the power play made it a uh, five to four game. No scoring up until the 15-42 mark of the third when Jaden Fodchuk picks up his second of the year. Rourke Appleby made the save, but he pushed it right to Fodchuk and puts it in. Bryce Sucro and Locke Sodergren pick up the assist. Danik LaRue came in, gets the win, and the Bucks win it 6-4, the final score.